Let's talk about one of the events that happens in triathlon, and that is swimming. Now, there's also a championship that was happening over the weekend, and uh, this was in Mombasa, where Tugi Mwige, she swims for Mombasa Aquatics, and she managed to clock about 2 minutes, 34.60 seconds. That was a new Coast Amateur Swimming Association record for girls at, aged between 14 years and above. Uh, in the 200 meters backstroke, Wakabi. Yes, uh, Tugi looks like one for the future. She won three uh, on the day. And, and when you see the differences, the way she swam, and remember, it's a family affair because the record she broke belongs to her elder sister, Kenya, which she set three years ago. So again, it's a, it's a great thing when you see there seems to be quite a bit of promise. And it's not just her. There was the, also the Amina Sheikh, 11 year old, again, going in there and winning too. And all this just tells you, because you've got to start them early. In all the other sports we complain about, or oh, they pick up rugby when they are 16, or oh, they pick up football when they are 15. This is 11-year-old, 14-year-olds, and hopefully we can build on it. Because we've shown in the past, mm -hmm. this country has got that ability to produce good swimmers, whether it's the Danfors, whether it's a Julu. There is always that potential. So let it start. And better yet, starting in Mombasa, I mean Mombasa, the ocean, yes. the beach, everything just sort of comes in together. So we're also looking at in terms of the 2028, 2032 Olympic Games as well. Yes, this would be more 20, maybe more 2028, mm -hmm. quite possibly, because if someone is 11 in, in, in seven years, they're now going to be about 18 there. Okay. So maybe 2028, 2032. But more importantly, it's just to show them it can be done. And to see this kind of talent doesn't go to waste. And especially thinking about the way swimming has been in trouble in this country over the last few, the last two, two, two three years, it's just been commotion after commotion. It's nice to not talk about FINA, and caretaker committees and SDT and just talk about people who go in there and swim and they are good results. What is happening in the pool? That's what counts. Yeah. yeah no, <laughs> in Kenya, we, we tend to do a lot of what's happening outside. If you think about football, we are just talking. It's what's happening outside. Mm -hmm. uh, we're talking about hockey. What's happening outside? We talk about swimming. What's been happening outside for the longest time? Mm -hmm. Fina were in the country a few weeks ago. Good to see actual swimming in the pool. Right.